Hey guys, today we're talking about the region parameter menu. The region parameter menu can be used to manipulate regions, audio and MIDI when editing in Logic. The menu changes based on the region selected. So here I have a MIDI region selected. As you can see, Quantize is available and it isn't available initially when I select an audio region. This changes for the audio region depending on whether Flex and Follow is enabled. If it's enabled, as I will now, it'll analyze the transients for the entire track, but doesn't necessarily have to enable flex and follow functions for the entire track and all regions. So on this region, now you can see Quantas has become available. If I select another audio region without flex and follow enabled, you'll see the Quantas is not showing. But what's really important beyond the obvious features is the more menu. The more menu allows you to change the track delay for both audio and MIDI regions. On the MIDI regions, you have dynamics. You can see gate time. If you quantize a region, additional functions become available, Q swing, Q velocity, etc. In the audio menu, there are things that are available and they become unavailable if flex time is enabled. So let's select a piece of audio and play what is a guitar track, an R&B song. But on this region, because flex time is not there, I can enable reverse. People are always asking about how to reverse a region in Logic. Well, in region parameters, you can do that pretty easily without destructively editing. Really simple. So it's also effective when crossfading between two audio regions. So if I select an audio region and I want to fade that, I can quickly use the fade tool to crossfade between the regions. But here, if I select that fade, you'll see that the fade out parameter can be changed really precisely via this fade out menu here. You can change the crossfade type, equal power, the S curve crossfade, which uh, if I zoom here, you'll be able to see it a little better. But all those parameters available in the region's parameter menu, you can't get to them any other way. You can't change this directly from the region. You can only change that from the region parameter menu. Fade in, fade out, fade in type, and fade out type. All useful functions uh, on audio regions. The MIDI region functions in the more menu affect clip length, the quantized values, as I said, and the quantized strength. So this is a very useful place to make changes to your regions, and it does not affect other regions. So if I select one region, those changes I make only affect that region or any group of selected regions. So this region, which is not selected, would not be affected by changes I make in this menu. It's really cool when you're making changes to drum programs where you have a fill that you don't want quantized and you might want another section quantized. So you can have a really dynamic performance without affecting every single region the same way and allows them to sound more realistic, honestly. So I hope that helps.